Hi guys, Vlogtober, day 27. <laughs> We're getting there. Um, but that means short story number 27, so let's just get right into it. 13-year-old Xander always wandered the woods that bordered his home. His mom had always warned him not to go too deep into the forest, especially after his dad died when he was three years old. Xander always thought his mother was too overprotective because of what happened with his father. But one Halloween night when his mom was on a date, Xander decided to wander deeper into the woods than he was ever allowed to before. The forest got thicker the deeper he went, and then suddenly there was a clearing. There were flowers that shimmered under the moonlight. He had never seen flowers do that before. He knelt down to pick one up, and he moved it around. He realized that it wasn't only shimmering under the moonlight, but shimmering regardless. He was sure he had never seen anything like it before. He heard growling, so he jumped to his feet, prepared to run. A large, majestic wolf stood there, staring at him, with eyes piercing yellow. Xander stared at the majestic creature. He couldn't explain this connection that seemed to be pulling them together. Who are you? The wolf asked. Did you just talk? Xander asked, confused. Of course. My name is Tala, the wolf said. The wolf transformed into a 13-year-old girl with red hair. Xander shook his head, trying to process what he just saw. I know, it's crazy, but I'm a werewolf. Xander started to back away as Tala looked at him, tilting her head to the side. You are too, Tala said. No, I'm not, Xander said. <laughs> All right, Tala said with a slight chuckle. What is this place? Xander asked. The werewolf den. A safe harbor for us. You know, the world fears us. Say we're just wild and vicious, but they don't understand us. A nice witch named Juniper enchanted this place for us. Made it so that no non-magical being can enter. Did you say Juniper? Xander asked. Yeah, why? My mom's name is Juniper. Tala just looked at him. Do you think my mom is the same Juniper who enchanted this place? Xander asked. Maybe that's why I was able to find it? Sure. Tala said. What? Xander asked. I told you, you're a werewolf too. She's right, a voice said from behind him. Xander turned around and saw his mother Juniper standing there. Xander looked at his mother with confusion. I should have told you, but I was worried, Juniper said. Your father was a werewolf. He passed it down to you. How long have you known? Xander asked since you were a baby i didn't tell you because i was afraid your father was attacked by fearful people that's how he xander said juniper nodded silver bullet through the heart xander looked around so you did all of this you created this safe haven for the other werewolves with your magic. Yes. You are a remarkable young man. You inherited many gifts. From your father. And from me. I'm a werewolf. And a witch? Xander asked. Yes. Juniper said. And you never bothered to tell me. If I hadn't come here, would you have ever told me? No, Juniper said. It would have been for your own good, too. The people out there don't understand us. They never have and they never will. I wanted to shield you from that life. You don't get to make that choice for me, Xander said angrily. I had the right to know. I had the right to know who I am. Xander took off. I'll go after him. He'll be all right, Tala said. Tala ran after Xander, transforming back into a werewolf. 
Tala jumped in front of Xander. I'm not in the mood, Xander said. You need to listen, Tala said. I was young like you when your dad died, but I heard the stories. We all did. The story served as a warning. Be careful in the real world. Be careful who you trust. Look, just try to see it from your mom's perspective. Not only are you a werewolf, a creature the world fears, but you're also a witch. Statistically, things haven't exactly worked out for witches in the past either. You are your mother's whole world. She tells us all the time. She couldn't risk losing you like she lost your dad. But it's my life, Xander said. I get it. But take a step back and look at it through her eyes. Life as a werewolf poses its complications. She was trying to spare you. I could have had this whole community. I could have had people who understood me. And you do, Tella said. We're not going anywhere. You're always welcome here. Look, you need your mom as much as she needs you. Just go back to her and talk to her. I'm just so angry, Xander said. And you're allowed to be. Just don't stew in it too much. Now, come on. Let's go back to your mom. Xander and Tala headed back to Juniper. The end. Okay, so initially this was going to be, you know, Xander finding out that he's a werewolf. Then we threw in the witch because Marvel. (laughs) Because Marvel has put me in such a witchy mood this Halloween season, like an immense witchy mood so we're kind of being ruled by the witches right now and so not only does Xander find out he's a werewolf but he also finds out that he's a witch it's fine it's fine it's the the more magical beings the better (laughs) um but yeah anyways let me know what did you guys think of this story and come back tomorrow for day 28 of vlogtober Bye, guys. Thank <laughs> you.